House training is an essential part of dog ownership if you are planning on allowing your Bernie Doodle to spend any length of time in the house. This breed needs this option because they get lonely easily. Just like any other puppy behavior, your new Bernie Doodle might not understand that it isn't allowed to use the bathroom where it pleases. If your Bernie Doodle came from a knowledgeable breeder, the breeder may have already started house training the puppies. However, the concept will still be very new, so more work is required. Before I move on with the video, I want to ask you a simple question. Do you want to train your dog for any basic commands like sit and stay? Do you want to stop any of the behavioral problems of your dog like pooping inside the house, biting, jumping, or barking? If your answer is yes, please grab the free dog training secrets guide in which I have disclosed the deepest dog training secrets that professional dog trainers don't want you to know about. These training secrets would help you have a well-behaved, super intelligent, smart and obedient dog without spending hours in training him or her. The Secret Training Technique ebook is available for free only for a limited time. So go and grab it before it's too late. Link to the free ebook and training videos is in the description below. House Training Options Depending on your home and schedule, there are different options for house training that won't result in ruined carpet. Using a designated spot outside is perhaps the most ideal method because your dog is less likely to be confused by your expectations for it. It can easily tell the difference between the backyard and the living room, so once it's let outside, it knows it's allowed to use the bathroom. Owners may also find they prefer to only allow their dog to potty outside because it keeps the pet messes out of the home altogether. However, if certain circumstances make this impossible for you and your pup, there are other options. You may decide to teach your puppy to do its business on a designated indoor spot while you're away, and to use the yard when you're home. For inside training, there are a few different choices. Using newspaper is a fairly common, and cheap, method, but it can result in messes if the layer of paper isn't thick enough to absorb the urine. Potty pads are another popular product. Think of them as large, absorbent diapers that adhere to your floor. Many contain a scent that is supposed to let your dog know that they are meant to be used as a toilet. They are disposable, so cleanup is easy. Because they are not reusable, prolonged use can be expensive and not great for the environment. However, as a backup method for dogs that are inside all day while the family is away, they can help contain accidents. Dog owners looking for a more permanent indoor toilet may choose a dog litter box or a box that can be covered in turf or sod to mimic an outdoor toilet. These methods are best suited for small dogs and puppies, so your Bernie Doodle may not be able to use them for too long before it reaches its adult size. If you decide to go with an indoor potty, placement is important. Find a space in your home where messes won't interfere with your life. Also, don't place a pad in an inconvenient place, just because your dog fancies that place for a toilet. For example, your puppy may like to do its business in the middle of your kitchen floor, but it's not a sanitary place to have those messes. Put a pad as far away from living spaces as possible, in a place like the bathroom, and teach your dog to go there. However, if you don't want your dog to become comfortable using your home as a toilet, you may want to avoid training it to use alternative methods altogether. This is entirely possible if you are capable of taking your dog outside every few hours during its puppy stage. As it grows up, letting it out during a lunch break or with a dog walker may be sufficient for its needs. Crate Training One of the benefits of crate training your dog is that it helps with the house training process. As a dog matures, it's less likely to use the bathroom in its living space. A crate provides an enclosed area that your dog may be more inclined to keep clean. This is beneficial for dog owners who struggle with their dog having accidents at night and while they're not around. If the dog hangs out in the crate when it cannot be closely supervised, it may avoid having accidents that way. If the crate is too big, there is ample room for a puppy to poop on one side and sleep on the other. A proper fitting crate eliminates that excess room. Once you let the dog out of the crate, immediately take it outside to eliminate waste. Avoid keeping potty pads or newspaper in the crate if your dog associates them with using the bathroom. If accidents occur, wash whatever bedding is in there and try again. Specially made enzymatic cleansers are good for removing the smells that make animals use the bathroom in certain areas. Do you want to have a well-behaved, obedient and calm pet dog without spending hours in training him? 
Check out the first link in the description and download the secret training technique guide absolutely free. It is available for free only for a limited period of time. Thanks for watching the video. Comment below if you like the video. Please subscribe to the channel Little Paws Training if you are serious about training and grooming your dog. Also, join our Facebook group where you get all the solutions to your daily doggy problems.